A Cecil County woman is facing several charges, including attempted murder, after investigators say she set her home on fire and then sat in a chair and watched it burn. Witnesses reported seeing 47-year-old Gail Metwally set several fires at her home in Elkton, even though another person was inside. Bystanders heard the victim screaming for help. They rescued her from a window. Metwally is charged with first and second degree attempted murder arson and other charges what's up youtube this is james coming back at you with another informative video i hope you guys are doing well out there on this nice beautiful friday i'm doing pretty good myself uh, shabbat shalom to all the brothers and sisters in recognition to observing this day for worship in the most high sundown this evening to sundown tomorrow evening let's get some worship and praises in my people let's let the most high know in the name of yahweh shai name in his name that we are thinking of him okay let's thank him for everything that he does for us in our day-to-day -day lives okay we need to do this as a collective okay now look the way things are going in this country it basically <laughs> reflects this movie that came out in 2010 called the crazies okay and just a little brief synopsis about the movie, The Crazies, all right? Um, a strange, insecure plane crash, you know, with an unusual toxin, toxic virus, okay? It was a toxic virus, you know, uh, entered a small town, all right? And basically what it did when that virus got released, it started causing the people in that town to start doing a lot of bizarre, crazy things. You know, they start acting like zombies. All right. And just running amok, basically. Y'all check that movie out. I'm telling you, you will see a lot of um, parallels with what's actually going on today. All right. As in this particular story. All right. Woman watches home burn in lawn chair after allegedly sitting it on fire. The person inside there is no allegedly she did it okay <laughs> she did it i have another video where you can see her doing it we're going we're going to check that out it's a couple minutes long you know about two and a half minutes and you're going to see her on camera doing this all right see but let's get into this story and uh dissect this for ourselves a woman in maryland has been arrested for allegedly setting her home on fire while a person was inside before sitting in a lawn chair to watch it burn. Gail Metwally, 47, is facing arson charges and a charge for attempted murder after the April 29th fire at the Elkton home. Well, at her Elkton home. Deputy State Fire Marshals said the fire was started shortly after 1 p.m. as a video from the neighbors seemed to show Elton sitting in a lawn chair. <laughs> seemed to show. See, they be trying to give, you know, um, these people out. She was sitting in the lawn chair. She kicked back and watched the damn house burn, I'm telling you. Now, to continue, see, this is the video right here, but we're going to finish this uh, article first, then we'll check it out. Y'all going to see this woman in action, all right? She's one of the crazies. Now, to continue here, witnesses responded observing a woman sitting, setting multiple fires within the home and then sitting in a lawn chair on the front lawn where she watched the fire engulf the home. A statement read, after a few minutes, Met Wally walked away from the scene. While the home was on fire, witnesses heard an occupant in a basement window yelling for help. Bystanders safely assisted her out of the window. The woman neighbor's rescue was one of the Met Wally's three housemates. Met Wally was later detained and transported to the Maryland State Police North East Barack. Uh, according to police, Met Wally is being charged with first and second degree attempted murder, first degree arson, first degree assault, two counts of first degree malicious burning. Two counts of malicious destruction of property and two counts of reckless endangerment. Crazy ass trick, I'm telling you. 
You know, this woman is crazy. And that's all there is to it. And uh, I read another article where they was trying to give her a way out. Guess what? Mental illness. But let's check this video out. And you'll, you'll see for yourself how Met Wally sit in the damn lawn chair, kick back while that house was on fire. She just fucking lit the trash can on fire and dumped it in the fucking living room. Dude, she's about to burn the fucking house down, dude. Oh my fucking god, this is not happening right now. She lit the fucking pot. Watch the house go up in flames. Oh my god. I, I cannot actually believe my eyes. I cannot actually believe it. And she's sitting there just chilling, watching the house go up in flames. Oh my God. Oh my God. I actually can't believe this. And she's just chilling back. Like, yeah, I'm watching this shit go down. With them dirty ass, nasty looking feet. <laughs> oh. Oh my God, this is this is now turned into a serious, serious thing. They get out of the house! It's on fire! Get out of the house! Hurry! Come on, hurry! Grab your stuff! just fell. Oh my god, it's got worse. Oh my god, it's coming out the back. Heavy. Oh my god. It's getting big. So you guys seen for yourselves, this was not an alleged act. She actually did it. This crazy ass woman right here set that house on fire and that woman was down in that basement hollering for help. You understand? And she would have died down there had it not been for the most high sending somebody to help her. You understand that? Y'all, excuse me. This thing just knocked everything off. There it is. Uh, yeah, if he had for if it wasn't for the most high sending, you know, help for that woman, you understand she would have died in that fire just because this evil ass woman. I don't know what kind of beef she had with that woman to do something so damn heinous. But she did it, nevertheless. And this just proves we are living among the crazies. Okay? Y'all tell me what y'all think about this story right here. I'm interested in hearing your thoughts, your views and opinions on it. Like, comment, share, and subscribe. People, please remember to live your life as though we are being watched, simply because we are. This is James, and I'm out. Peace.